I guess we can't hang out anymore. I guess not. That sucks, because I really like spending time with you. Me too. <laughs> what are you doing? Now them Griffin boys better grow some wings or start flapping their arms. Lost him! Dead blasted Lincoln lovers! Anyone seen my foot? Man, was last night weird. I kissed a boy, but the truth is, I really like him as a friend. His name is Sam. You kissed Sam last night? How did you know? Well, you're saying it out loud. I could hear you in the other room. You know, the weird thing is, kissing Sam kind of felt right, but I don't know if I can face him again. Brian, what should I do? I haven't been this confused since the end of No Way Out. How does Kevin Costner keep getting work? Ah, how do I shoot? How do I shoot? Press B, B button. Telegram for Chris Griffin. Oh, he's not here. Well, where is he? I can't release that information. Oh, uh, did I say Chris? I meant Chris's sister. Oh, oh, well, if it's for Meg, that's a whole other story. Here's her address. What are you doing? You were busy, so I played your guy. Fine, I didn't want to play anyway. Well, then it worked out for everybody. I'm gonna go draw boobs on the Etch-A-Sketch. Go ahead, they always come out square. Oh, hi, Chris. Hey. Um, listen, Sam, I like hanging out with you and all. It's just that I don't want a romantic relationship. But I'd like it if we could still be friends. I'd like that, too. Want to go for a swim? Sure. <gasps> You're a girl? Of course I am. Oh, my god! Warm am out today. Warm yesterday. Even warmer today. Met her on my CB, said her name was Mimi, sounded like an angel come to earth. When I went to meet her, man, you should have seen her, twice as tall as me, three times the girl. Oh, my fat baby loves to eat. Loves to eat. A big old Buddha belly and a breast swing past her feet. Eat. My fat baby loves to eat. My big old fat ass baby loves to eat. Sam, can I talk to you? Sure, but why aren't you looking at me? Well, that's the thing. Um, I'm no good at talking to girls. That's why I ran away from you. Well, you didn't have trouble talking to me when you thought I was a boy. Yeah, that's true. And just pretend I'm a boy. Okay. You want to go down to the Old Town Bridge and make out? Yes, sir. And in the city, glasses are considered really sexy. <gasps> Dang, I hope her brother don't already have dibs on her. Meg, where's Chris? That criminal's here and he's after him. He's down by the Old Town Bridge. You know, my brother is the one he's here to kill. My daughter would absolutely love you. You're so cute. You're like a skinny Garth Brooks. Aha! I got you now, Griffin. Ah! Not so fast, buddy. Who are you? Oh, you can call me Officer T.J. Hooker. Sheriff Officer T.J. Hooker. And this is my deputy, McMillan and wife. Well, I hated T.J. Hooker, and I never actually saw McMillan and wife, although I was aware of it. Anyway, you're dead! Ha! You're mine now, fella. Folks, all right? Wow, you guys saved our lives. And after I said that all Southern people have bad teeth and suffer from the gum disease known as gingivitis. Well, we take care of our own. And as long as y'all live here, y'all are Southerners too. Wow, thanks. It's our pleasure. Sam, I'll see you at home. You know, I think the lesson here is it really doesn't matter where you're from as long as we're all the same religion. It was great having you in class, Meg. Thanks. I'm really gonna miss everybody. We didn't have no money for a present, so we all just spit in a jar. I can't believe you're leaving. Me either. I'll be sure to write. And I'll be sure to learn to read. And next time I see a dead guy, I'm gonna poke him twice as hard for both of us. 